This is the second video on how to use the editing commands in Dr. Racket. In this video, I'm going to introduce you to even cooler features, if that's possible, than those in the first video. Specifically, automatic parentheses. In order to enable automatic parentheses, you're going to want to go to the Preferences menu and choose the Editing tab and then the General sub-tab. And in there, click on Enable Automatic Parentheses. You will probably also want, from the Square Bracket sub-tab, to enable Automatically Adjust Opening Square Brackets. When automatic parentheses are enabled and we type an opening parenthesis, we get a close parenthesis for free, and the cursor is placed in the middle, which is lovely if what we want to do is add three and four. Okay, let's watch that again. Open plus three, four. I didn't have to type the closing parenthesis, and more importantly, my parentheses were balanced the whole time. But what if I actually want to take two existing expressions three existing expressions or four existing expressions and wrap a pair of parentheses around them. It turns out that if I highlight them using the commands from the last video and then type an opening parenthesis, that what I get is an opening parenthesis before my selection and a closed parenthesis after my selection. Nifty. All right. I can do the same thing with square brackets. In fact, the square brackets are rather clever in, and try to infer where you're going to want square brackets and where you're going to want uh, round brackets. So for instance, in conditionals, it's customary to use square brackets for these definitions. And what you can't see is that, in fact, what I typed to create both of these was the same key. It was, in fact, the square bracket key. So I'm here, I'm typing the opening square bracket key which is creating a round parenthesis because Dr. Racket is guessing that's the right for this position. Then I type cond. Now I hit the same key again, opening square bracket, but this time it comes out square. If I hit it again, it comes out this time round. Less than three, four, whoop, true, else, false. <laughs> Spelled false. <laughs> out, out, okay. So using automatic parentheses, I can wrap round or square brackets around any set of expressions that I want, all the time keeping them balanced. That's awesome! And that's all I have to say to you right now.